everybody, Eddie V here today, and I got some nice new things in my tank today. I had, sorry for not updating for a while, I was quite busy, but here's some new things that I actually have updated on. I did happen to get a snowflake moray eel. He's around a foot long, he eats every three to four days, and he's good and healthy. So far, has not ate any of my fish. Or my big scarlet hermit crabs, I believe that's what they're called. I also got a few Pacilopora frags. They're growing quite well and are quite healthy. Some pink tip ones, a green, I believe it's called a green hairy one. And then we got some regular greens and some blues in there as well mixed. Got some proto pallies, two different variations. Got some Montiporas. One glued to the back of my glass there. I glued a small Zoa there trying to grow it out. And then I did happen to get this, which are around $30 a polyp, green pally. And when they extend, they're huge and bright dark green. Also, I do have this cabbage leather coral that was like half the size three months ago, and it grew that big. I got frags and hammer corals. One of these I got for free because it was basically dead and as you can see now there's polyps coming out of this one right here. So I got these zoas here. I got another frag of Pacillopora in that area. <clears throat> My pur purple gargoyan actually just closed up. It was when it opens up, you have these nice yellow polyps. I have a chalice coral. I also have a Montipora. The lighting is kind of blocked out, but it has green tips inside. I also got a green fuzzy mushroom. And I also got a pipe organ coral that right now is closed up, but it was open last night, so I know it's healthy. And the green star polyp that was opening up a few minutes ago, but I closed up again. I also got a green spotted madrin. Where did she go? It's a female. There she is. Green spotted madrin go in, in here. She's doing beautiful, beautiful and healthy. I also got a frag of Akins. That look nice and cool. I think there's three heads in that one. I got a green Montipora, got a green Lepto, also got a, red, a green Madrin Gobi, a male. These colors come out nice when he displays them. So everything in my tank is doing well so far. As you can see it has some nice growth in the Pacilla Pora corals. They were like a little bit smaller a few weeks ago and they're just blooming and growing so I updated this tank quite a bit I did manage to get a yellow tang I don't know if it was in my last update video I also got a sailfin tang which is doing healthy it had ick on it but after some strong feeding and keeping it healthy well fed it's the egg just went away because I was giving it garlic supplements. So if you ever have egg, the best thing to do is to give it garlic supplements. So tell me what you guys think in the comments. Like, subscribe. Also, another quick update. This Kenya tree coral was around three times as small six months ago. Now it's around, if it extends, it can extend up to, I think, five inches from the base of it to the tip. And it was only one inch extension last time. So that was six months ago. Things do grow here. I think it's very healthy as you can see. Now that's all for it this time. Let me know what you think in the comments. Signing off.